Hello everybody, my name is Bob, and this is No Man's Sky. Um, oh, right there. Uh, I don't know how well this is going to work, because I am having serious problems issues playing this game, uh, but we will see. Uh, also, I don't know how exciting it's going to be, because um, uh, I'm uh, mostly going to grind money. Uh, I want to buy a ship, a better ship than whatever that one is. Whatever it is. The Rimasaka S57, which is not a bad ship, but it doesn't have enough cargo space, so uh, or enough uh, slots in it. So we need to uh, get about three and a half million dollars together and, uh, and buy a real nice one. So. I just did an update, so it may be playing a little better than uh, it often does. It has been up to this point. Uh, let us refuel that. Technology recharge. Uh, basically, what I'm looking for here is a uh, very nasty planet uh, with um, uh, <coughs> lots of um, lots of stuff in it. I feel that that planet has three moons, perhaps. Uh, I might get uh, might get nabbed by pirates. We'll see. And one problem with this game is um, uh, it's very difficult to uh, look around. Um, there's no pre look or anything. This is an interesting little planet. Uh, let's go to the space station right quick. I'll probably be doing this a lot of this um, uh, off camera because uh, <coughs> well, I'm pretty much just going to be grinding pretty much. Um, so uh, my observations of the game, uh, uh, it is definitely not uh, in a lot of ways a finished product. Um, it is very appealing in other ways, but um, uh, a little bit grindy. Uh, but um, uh, but it, it has potential. Uh, they just need to you know pick, finish their games before they put them out in the world. I'm gonna be looking around, seeing what all's around here. Because, uh, alright, that's where I came from. It doesn't appear to have any moons, or if it has moons, it's on the other side. Uh, that is undiscovered. That looks a little hostile. Maybe that'll be good for, um, good for, um, getting stuff. Sometimes bad worlds are better for uh, grinding, mining, and stuff. Oh, hello. What are you? Oh, um, nope.
offload some of my junk here and then go to that planet. Part's pretty boring, so I'll skip it. Okay, to get new mining tech, uh, mining uh, cooling beam tech, whatever they call it, uh, I'm going to need to uh, get some upgrade, uh, which I didn't have in the market. So uh, we'll, we'll just go ahead and head on to that planet and uh, see if we can find some. Uh, what I really need is uh, uh, some place with a, like a market on the, the ground here. Let's pull out here. Uh, a marketplace here on the ground. Colony thing. Yes. This looks like a suitably hostile planet. Uh, and uh, then a source of, but for the uh, grinding part, it be a source of iron and a source of plutonium uh, so I can make bypass chips and sell those. Yeah! Burning up, I'm burning up. This looks like a very unpleasant planet. It's got life of some kind. What's this? That there is a rod iridium, iridium, whatever you call it. Got some mushrooms going on here. Unfortunately, you can't use your mining beam on the planet, and I bet that's not only that's nickel or something. Shit. I'm not going to be hunting for shit for a while. Okay, this here is emerald. Uh, it usually doesn't appear in this form, uh, but uh, um, it's actually uh, very profitable to mine, uh, actually more so than gold off of That's a default. No, it's not. Alright, what I really want to find out is what this is. If it's aluminum, I can get the new cooling tech from a mining bean, uh, which is good because that means you can... If that is aluminum, we are we are, we are business. Let me see what the going rate from Little Miss. Uh, it is uh, 165 each. That is uh, 225 each. So we'll just get enough for our own purposes here. Uh, you have to refuel your mining beam. Um, usually, plutonium is pretty common to. Uh, Around, but you can also find carbon, carbon like plants like that. <coughs> it doesn't really pay to get too far from your starship because uh, uh, you don't walk very fast, uh, and uh, and so getting anywhere on foot is quite uh, unpleasant. How much? How full am I? Toxic protection. Falling. Technology recharge. Life support power. Low. Technology recharge. I'm getting this because uh, <coughs> if I can find some place that has a trading station, I can uh, uh, I can make uh, bypass chips and make some money that way. Okay, what I did is I crafted a bypass chip uh, to uh, access this antenna here, uh, and I'm going to look for shelter. So I'm trying to find a, tra a trading post. It may it may direct me to a drop drop pod, which is fine. Yeah, it just did. Because uh, I can always use an uh, expansion slot. Uh, I'm gonna try it again. Yeah, 
Yeah, I was just there. Thank you. Thank you so much for your help. Yeah. That is shuffle. All righty then. Okay, this is a drop pod. Now what you get out of that is uh, upgrades to your exosuit to uh, give you more slots. So, uh, and they increase in price the more we have. Uh, so I've got quite a few. So this is going to cost me 180,000 units. Which is a lot of dough, but I mean, uh, if you're doing heavy uh, crafting, it could be, uh, it could be worth it. Pay for itself. Let me do a quick scan to see if there's any, uh, any of that. Zinc for uh, replenishing your uh, your uh, armor, basically, uh, and for uh, replenishing your ship's uh, armor. All right. Well, this is not thrilling. All right. This is quite a hellish uh, planet. Um, whether I want to stay here depends on whether uh, we have um, uh, we have um, yeah that stuff we have that stuff okay. uh, apparently this is very uh, hard on my suit red knots Very hostile planet. Exosuit, please. Exosuit, please. Thank you. I'm just gonna. Technology Gonna uh, bear down on my metals pretty, pretty bad. Oh, it's already down below. Down low. Damn it. Alright, well, I'm just gonna have to use. Yeah. Very extreme environment. Alright, more plutonium. This is an unsafe planet. More slots. Alright, we'll do 
Freunde. I tried to find a trading bus straight away and
So it doesn't appear to be a very mineral mineral rich planet anyway, so probably gonna be going going off somewhere. Somewhere else. Might actually just be warping to the next system. Okay, this uh, star system is a bit of a loser, I think, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, warp on to the next uh orbital station coordinates received. Okay. Um, I've never, never been very, uh... Good with this interface. Alright, four planets, two moons. That's not too bad. Oh, no. Alright, whatever. Oh, the colors, man. The colors. Too much of that warp acid. I think I can see the wall breathe. Sorry if the audio is a little bit loud. I turned it down. It doesn't seem like I turned it down enough. Whoa. Gotta get an overview of what's what's around here. here. That over there is a fairly pleasant looking place, but that's not always a good thing. Let's go ahead and go here. Some uh, other gold or emerald right there, so that's a good sign. All right, how toxic is this planet? Thank you for telling me that. Let's move along. All right. Well, this may take a while. Oh wow, this is trippy. I was following this gold gold vein in here, uh, and I, uh, underneath it, I discovered a cave. That's kind of cool. This multi tool just wrecks it. I've got a lot of upgrades to the tool, so it just absolutely wrecks. Uh, well, after I'm done with this, I'll go explore that cave a little bit. Okay, this is a fairly small cave. I think it is. There'd be some more back there, but let's go ahead and... I just need to get rid of this gold and then uh, find a market somewhere. I need to sell a bunch of shit. Alright, it's actually theoretically possible I may not get out of here. Let's find out. Ah, I made it, just barely. Just barely. Alright, let's find a trader. I got a bunch of shit I gotta sell. Oh, there's a trader right here. You can tell because they got a landing pad.
color scheme. Alrighty, I'm about two thirds up of the way to my goal of uh, about three and a half million dollars. I want to get for uh, to get a fully uh, upgraded ship as far as the number of slots on it. So, uh, I actually made an offer up this guy on this ship, but uh, it, it was about uh, a little more than I had, and also you know, there was not quite a few slots up on it. So, uh, so I, I let it go. Uh, so that's all for right now. Until next time, hasta la vista. Adios.